We're here at the Annie rehearsal in the old Village Hall of Orland Park that we've uh, been rehearsing for quite a while now. And I'm, uh, I'm joined by two of the cast members, one playing Annie, one playing Rooster, Eric Walton, the father, and Sarah Walton, his daughter. They're integral parts of the show it's a uh, I, 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 I'm hesitating to talk because I have to before I want to get this out of the way right now I have to say that Eric I've um, I, I it, we, even in rehearsal I always have to stop, even if I'm if I'm uh, doing my own, you know, practicing my own lines. I have to stop and watch when you're seeing us, because it's a it's an absolute. And I don't say this just to schmooze, but it's an absolute pleasure to watch you in action. You are, you you you're you're just you're good. You're real. Not that everybody else, everybody in this cast is very good, but he's as 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 Daddy Warbucks likes to say, he's our ringer. So Eric is, uh, uh, give us a little background on some of your experience. I'm focusing on the show, but what your experience that has brought you here? Uh, my background is uh, through my college years I ended up uh, performing for 17 seasons as a singer dancer at all these different theme parks across the country so I was basically semi-professional but then I really wanted to make sure that I got a house and had a nice car and a nice job and start a family <laughs> so rather than going the route of being a professional performer I decided that uh, my outlet would be community theater yeah and so I for about the last 15 to 18 years or so I've been around the whole Chicago area doing a lot of shows and basically have my outlet and uh, Annie is the first is my first show as well as my daughter with uh, the Orland Park troupe and this is also the first time that Annie and I are actually doing a show together in the same cast yeah it, which is you know shine dad well <laughs> yeah she she very well made she is cuter as uh, Margie <laughs> liked to point out but it's uh, you both do a phenomenal job and what what uh, what drew you to the Orland Park theater troupe you you probably were drawn first because I I think I do remember and I don't want to step in but I remember you telling me you you when you first came you were not even uh, you you were not even inclined to audition the first you brought Annie and then she uh, tried and looked like she was going to be in the show you saw so you thought going to be here anyway let's try out right let's try out if if there was a good chance that maybe my daughter could get into the show then I thought you know what I have some time. It'll work out of my schedule, and I said, "All right, yeah, I'll, I'll audition." But I made that yeah. decision within an hour of the audition. Yeah, and then and the rest is history. So, Sarah, what uh, what has been your experience in community in theater? How many shows have you done? I've actually done about eleven shows 11 in community shows. theater. I've less been seen in Be as Belle and Beauty and the Beast, and I've also been like Jiminy Cricket and Pinocchio, and many different more shows. Great shows, all very good shows. <laughs> what influence has your father been on your career? Did he? Do well, let me just ask you a point blank. Did he discover your voice? Um. <laughs> Mom discovered your. Well, you can give credit to your mother. She's uh, mom. Uh, thank you. Was it was it your mother? Or? It was well, or, my mom. Or was it your grandmother? It was your, probably both of them because yeah. they've both really been into musical theater, and I've learned like a lot of voice techniques from my mom. And my dad's really helped me like become a better performer throughout my years. So that's great. That's great. You do a you do a great job, <laughs> doing a phenomenal job. Now you're from New Lenox, mm -hmm. so you're uh, you're you're close to Orland Park. This is the Orland Park Theater Troupe. Hopefully, we'll see you in a lot of shows for the Orland Park Theater Troupe in the coming in the ensuing um, you know ensuing years Absolutely. you guys so to, you, do, to. you do a tremendous job now who are you uh, wh who are you playing in the show Eric I'm Rooster Hannigan I'm the character who ends up putting this scheme together to try and get the fifty thousand dollars from daddy Warbucks to f as he's trying to look for uh, Annie's real parents and so the orphanage director Mrs. Hannigan is played you know is my sister in the show so we put together the scheme to pretend to be Annie's parents so we can get the money and then kill her and of course that does get <laughs> thwarted but uh, it's a lot of fun part for me because it's only about three scenes or so that I get to have a good time while my daughter playing the role of Annie gets to be throughout the entire show so yeah. the best part is actually just sitting backstage while we're doing run-throughs and watching my daughter do what she does it's yeah. It's really a neat experience because I've done so many shows and now I get to see my daughter do it. And I'm actually quite proud and exciting, excited to be in a show you know that I can be so proud of my daughter. Yeah, and it's got to be really neat. It's got to be great being able to work work with your daughter. Now, do you enjoy watching your father and watching him hone his craft? 
He's very good. He practices sometimes at home, and sometimes he'll just break out into song. And it, he's really good. He's I, really good. Do you yeah. join in with him when he breaks out into song back at uh, Sometimes, at yeah. I'll be like, woohoo. Now, do we have really a favorite dancing. family musical? If you guys were going to go to a musical, if you had a chance to go to a Broadway musical, do you have a favorite one that you want to go to? Um, no? No favorite musical? Uh, I've always liked the, the show Joseph, and I've, yeah. I've gotten to do that show three times already. Oh. It's Joseph and Levi and Joseph again. So the, the, yeah, there's, I think everyone has a, a few favorites. Yeah. And, yeah. Uh, but it, being a young, you know, a young performer as my daughter is, I mean, there's only a handful of shows that they have you know, young performers in. Yeah. And so this is, this is huge for my daughter yeah, to play yeah. Annie. I never got to play Oliver, so no. I'm kind of envious that she's getting you to play the Annie out. at such you a young the age. Out. You know, they have Oliver going on right now at Drury Lane. You no. could have uh, <laughs> went in and tried it. but That's uh, not as Oliver. <laughs> that is Oliver, no, but it's, uh, Thanks, yes, yes, but it's, uh, last question, mm -hmm. uh, we got enough uh, about the theater, as we, uh, it's, it's a family uh, fair here, what's the family vacation plan for the summer? Go ahead. Oh, we're actually going to be traveling to England this summer. Oh, you'll be going to visit the land of the Rolling Stones. <laughs> yeah, my... My yeah. aunt and my uncle and then one of my cousins lives there, oh, and so it'll be a lot wonderful. of fun to go there. Yeah. I'm going to be staying longer yeah. without Well, good luck. Have a lot of fun there. That'll be great. It'll no, be you'll see Big Ben and everything mm -hmm. there. No, that's mm -hmm. great. That really is. That's great. Well, got a lot of enlightening facts here, a lot of enlightening uh, tidbits, but we just want to thank Eric and Sarah for everything they do and for uh, being part of the Orland Park Theater community, and it's, it's going to be a wonderful show. Thank you both. Thank you. Thank you.